good? It's your boy TRNT, and I'm back one more again. This time I'm back with my brand new segment called First Time Hearing. But this time I'm about to listen to new songs that just got released this past weekend. I know I've been late slipping on New Music Friday, but we're about to do it tonight. And unlike the other YouTubers and reactors, I do not skip the songs. I do not pause the songs. I listen to the whole song, and at the end, I get my commentary. I grade each song from 0 to 10, 10 being the best. So if it's a trash song, y'all already know that's 5 and below. If it's mid, average, okay, that's a six. Now, if it's a good song, depending on me and y'all, that's seven to ten. So make sure y'all stay tuned to the end of each video, you dig? And when we get to 10K subscribers, there will be a Cash App giveaway at the end. So make sure y'all follow me on every social media, Lit Trent Music. It's spelled the same way as my channel. I'm live right now. We're going to catch a vibe on Twitch after. But for right now, this is first time here. You're fucking you fucking panties on a bunch of making reaction bits. <laughs> I hate you niggas that make reaction fans. Yo, this is my first time reacting to Tyler the Creator, Noy. And I'm watching the video, but I'm reacting to the music. So please stay to the end. It is. <laughs> See how you say it? Chromacopia. Chromacopia. Hey, man. First of all, we're about to talk about this one. Before I get my grade, we got to talk about it. First of all, let's give props to Tyler, the creator, just for his marketing on this album. Like, just trending on TikToks. Y'all can see it everywhere. Um, Tyler just dropped these different, um, these, like, uh, what they call them? Xanax? Tank? I forget what they call them, the shipping containers. They He dropped them in different cities. And one, he dropped that one in Dallas. Of course, he dropped one in Tyler, Texas, which is dope because Tyler, the creator. And he dropped one in Houston, Texas, which I seen a video where everybody, what the exact spot where he dropped it by, it was so many people like, oh, I've been, I've seen that place before. We pass it by it all the time. I like, I stayed with such, such minutes away from that place. But, they was thinking 
people from Houston was just talking about the steel place it was set in front of, but it was actually talking about the container, which they didn't know it had something to do with Tyler the Creator, which is I like one thing I love about that because Tyler the Creator, um, even though I'm not the biggest Tyler Creator fan, what's gonna make me react to this whole album is that marketing thing. I'm like, bro, that's how you let people know about your album without even saying you putting the album out. I like the different marketing strategies. This one was definitely top tier and it, it makes me want to react to a Tyler Creator album. And not only just the marketing, I'm not saying the marketing only, but in the last two years, he put out two dope ass albums that I heard great reviews from. I even heard a couple of songs that I liked, but I never dove into the album. I never actually reacted to a whole Tyler Creator album. So with that being said, I, I want to react to this album and I want to make this a top, like a top a priority of mine to react to the whole album. I want to take in from the intro to the beginning. I want to see why the Tyler fans mess with him. Like, I, I know he's a dope rapper. You know what I'm saying? He came out around the time in the 2010s and I just wasn't on that way. But I respect the fact that he dedicated his music to his fan base. He did his own thing. I like people that move their own way and grow and worry about their fan base. He wasn't trying to be, it's two type of rappers. You got the ones that want to, that big commercial success. And then you got the ones that want to stay underground. And this song is talking about that. When looking at the video, it's called Noid. I'm thinking like, oh, he's paranoid. He's, he built such a, a reputation his fans fuck when he can't go outside without feeling paranoid because rappers dying and people he from california they rob people in california you gotta you can't trust your friends you can't trust your baby mama is like he and this is what he grew into because he was just making music for the fun of it not knowing that he had a, a fan base and his fan base now grown so big is like now he feeling that superstar fit feeling not knowing that his music is the reason why people feel that way and i want to see what the hype about um if i had to rate the video even though i'm not rating the video i would get a video a 10 it would be in my top consideration of videos of the year if i was to do a top 10 which i might do this year i'm gonna do a lot of top 10s and i might do top 10 videos of the year if y'all ain't pay attention he talking about the shadows his shadow was doing something different than his body it was it was dope um but i like the song i want to see what the concept of the album i want to hear the album uh, zero out of ten. I would give this one an eight off a of first listen, but it could grow into an eight or nine or a ten. Who knows? I want to see what the album like. So whenever the album drop, let me know. Make sure y'all subscribe. Make sure y'all pop back in with me, and we're gonna react to the whole album. But for right now, this is kind of first time hearing new music Fridays mixed in one. We're about to react to some music. We're gonna catch a vibe on Twitch after this. So make sure y'all follow me on every social media. Look Trent Music is spelled the same way as this channel. So if y'all rocking out, click that next video. If not, I